Alright, so this is a quick little video of me playing Zelda. It's kind of difficult to do this because I'm playing on the DS and filming that. It's a little bit complicated. But um, I'm just using my previous save file here real quick. And uh, I'll run around in the world. This is Zelda Link to the Past. This was originally released on the Super Nintendo. But um, no longer have it on that system. So I'm playing on my DS right now. Which coincidentally is a uh, Zelda themed DS. Uh, I will show you guys later, but um, I'm sure many of you are familiar with this game, and uh, it had what they call the light in the dark world, so the way that we go back to the light world is we use this little mirror, and that's how it ports us back, but I stopped in a place where I can't be, so it just knocked me back, let's see if it'll work now, oh, here we go. So this is the light world. You can pick up rocks and go around the gigantic world and everything. This is like a wicked fun game. <laughs> we can take a look at the map over here. It's, you can see it's pretty big. There's your tiny little dot right there. And this is just one of the worlds. The dark world is just as big so we have two of these full maps and you have to explore everything in order to save Princess Zelda. Alright, this is about it. I'll show you the little Triforce, that's the symbol from the Zelda game. It means power, wisdom, and courage. And uh, it's a theme that revolves around all of the different Zelda games.